先忙听一遍。No, initially, um, I was like Aaron Sorkin, which who you would know, Aaron Sorkin. Love Aaron Sorkin. Oh, Aaron Sorkin, who wrote、um, the screenplay and directed the film,、um, said to me, "Would you be interested in in doing this?" And we zoomed, and I was like, "Yes, I would love to do anything with you."、Um, I read it and was just completely、um, captivated. It's an incredible story.、Uh, I, I want to talk more about the movie and how you got into character as Lucille Ball. 带字幕再听一遍 No, initially,、um, I was like. Aaron Sorkin, which who you would know, Aaron Sorkin. Love Aaron Sorkin. Oh, Aaron Sorkin, who wrote、um, the screenplay and directed the film,、um, said to me, "Would you be interested in in doing this?" And we zoomed, and I was like, "Yes, I would love to do anything with you."、Um, I read it and was just completely、um, captivated. It's an incredible story.、Uh, I, I want to talk more about the movie and how you got into character as Lucille Ball. No, initially,、um, I was like. Aaron Sorkin, which who you would know, Aaron Sorkin. No, initially I was like、um, Aaron Sorkin, which you would know, Aaron Sorkin, right? 好，那么这句话呢，读起来其实不难，因为我们的嘉宾他读的很慢。No, initially, 这里 initially 表示一开始、刚开始怎么怎么样。Initial 是一个形容词，表示起初的、刚开始的。那 initially 作为副词，那么就用来。修饰一个句子的，一开始怎么怎么样 ，right？ 好，那么呃，我们看到后面的一个语法现象，就两个，一个是 would，would， 这里的的需要进行一个爆破 ，right？ 还有包括后面的 right，right 就没有那个特出来。那么包括这个 would， 它需要去进行一个弱读的，不用读的很重。好，那么我们把重点放在这个 was like， 这里我需要去把这个 was like 给大家去进行一个讲解，这个 was like。那些 native speakers， 也就是以英语为母语的这些人是很喜欢用 was like。那 was like 可以翻译成 I said， 也可以翻译成 I thought。来给了大家第一个语境 ：I walked up to Randy and he was like， Why are you so late？ I was like， Because you gave me the wrong time。这里面的 he was like 就相当于 he said， 他说啊，我走到了 Randy 的跟前，他说。你为什么迟到了？好，后面的 I was like， 我说，因为你给了我错误的时间。那这里面的 I was like 和 He was like 就翻译成了 I said 和 He said。好，我们再来看到这句话 ：She called me this morning at 7:30， and I was like， Why are you waking me up so early？ 那这里面的 I was like 就相当于我在想，我认为，对吧？七点半就给我打电话。我那是在想，你为什么这么早就叫醒我呢？所以这个 I was like 就翻译成 I thought。所以这句话里面的 I was like 这些用法非常适用于很随意的对话，偶尔用起来会让人觉得你的口语非常的地道。但是呢，大家也注意不要太用太多，不要总是 I was like I was like。这样的话用用多了就会让人有点反感的，就像那个 you know 对吧？我听到有人说 you know， 我就会觉得很反感 ，right？ 啊，这些词其实说白了就是在口语里面可以去增加你的流利度的，可以让你显得比较的地道的。Aaron Sorkin, who wrote、um, the screenplay and directed the film,、um, said to me, "Would you be interested in in doing this?" And we zoomed, and I was like, "Yes, I would love to do anything with you."、Um, I read it and was just completely、um, captivated. It's an incredible story.、Uh, I... Aaron Sorkin, who wrote the screenplay and directed the film. Um, said to me, "Would you be interested in doing this?" And with Zoom, I was like, "Yes, I would love to do anything with you." I read it, and I was just completely captivated. It's an incredible story. 这句话虽然比较长，但是其实读好难度不大，因为读得很慢，语速不快啊。所以，我们来看到它的小体词部分，像这些冠词 the、and 连词，像这些词的话呢，我们都需要进行弱读。所以，你看 ，Who wrote the screenplay? And direct the film. The the 都没有听到的啊。Uh, and directed,、uh, said to me, to 就很很弱 ，right? Would you be interested in doing this? And we zoomed, right? 好，那么呃，大家去自己再听一遍，去注意一下这些弱读的部分。然后施暴的现象呢，我已经讲过很多遍了，看过我很多视频的应该都知道。像这些爆破音都是需要留嘴型补充器，像 wrote wrote the screenplay and and directed the film. Said to me, said to me. 这没有的啊。好，连读的话有三个，一个是 Would you, Would you, Would you be interested in doing right? Would you be interested in doing this? 好，后面还有我们的 Read it, Read it. I read it, and I was just like completely captivated. 
啊。那么在这段话里面呢，我们注意有一个词 zoomed，z o o m。实际上这个 zoom 是一个聊天软件。你看，其实英语当中它会用这些词，用的很活。你的英语很好了，你也可以用的这么火。那 Zoom 是一个聊天软件的名字，它把它做动词用，就是我们用 Zoom 来聊了天，来来对了话啊。We zoomed 就这么来用的。I want to talk more about the movie and how you got into character as Lucille Ball. I want to talk more about the movie and how you got into character as Lucille Ball. 好，我们来看到这句话里面的语音现象，像的 about 的，就是一个弱读的 and about the movie and how you got into character as right 这些弱读的地方，我们就时间短。呃，声音小，那就我们就可以达到弱读的一个效果了。好，然后呢，我们看到这个打波浪线的 want to， 它合到一起会变成 wanna，I wanna，wanna， 再注意几个爆破的现象就可以了。About about the movie and and how you got into 这些爆破的地方都是自留嘴型补充器。No, initially, um, I was like. Aaron Sorkin, which who you would know, Aaron Sorkin. Love Aaron Sorkin. Oh, Aaron Sorkin, who wrote、um, the screenplay and directed the film,、um, said to me, "Would you be interested in in doing this?" And we zoomed, and I was like, "Yes, I would love to do anything with you."、Um, I read it and was just completely、um, captivated. It's an incredible story.、Uh, I, I want to talk more about the movie and how you got into character as Lucille Ball. 